Okay, so this is lesson seven, seven ten. Yeah. Okay, so page three oh seven. So the ones that are here, I'll do number five with you here. Um, it's six and three tenths, and the subtraction. So we're subtracting one and four. So the number of tenths so now I want to find that I want the four to the four and my half Alright, how about, um, how about number 10? Let's look at number 10 here. I could see where that might be confusing to some. So we have 6, and we're subtracting 2 and 4 fifths. Alright, well there's no fraction next to the 6. So you could look at it this way if you want. You could borrow... 6 becomes a 5, and we might be using them here to keep it easy, and I could just write um, 5 over 5. And so the denominator is the same, which is really convenient, so we're just subtracting 4 from 5. So that's 1, and then 2 from 5 is 3 and 1 fifth. All right, we'll do one more. I'm going to do number 18. So, um, let me erase this. Give myself some room here. This is number 18. So that's 10 and 5 twelfths. And we're subtracting 4 and 7 and 8. Group one of his points. So the denominator would be, um, well, it's not going to be 12 because 8 doesn't go into 12 evenly. So I'm going to pick the largest denominator and double it, see what happens. And that'd be 24. So then I ask myself, well, 24, how many times? Twice. Times 5 is? 8 to 24. Three times. Seven is? Well, now we have that problem again where we have to borrow. So um, the 10 is a 9. What's the denominator we're using? 24. So I'm just going to add 24 to the top. Okay, so that becomes 4. 21. So I have a subtraction that I need to do. Okay? So 21 from 34, that's going to be 13 left over. 13 over 24. And then 4 from 5. 5 and 15. Remember, you add. Next page. All right. Let's look at this for a moment. Number 19, I do want you to do, and I want you to do all the other three. How many more does that make? Rounds it out. Okay. Who 
with 90 degrees, okay, 90 degrees, and of course, when you say that, you're right, you know, okay. So, um, if that's 90 degrees, it's 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 90 degrees, so every angle is, you know, it's a Catholic, you know, I'm sure that's going to be all those angles, it's all 90 degrees, you want this one, it's all 90 degrees, um, is it 90 degrees? No, 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 so that's how they're, that's, that's one, uh, one way that they're different, because it's asked how they're different. Now, you guys can phrase that any way you want, but I'm just pointing out to you, there's one way they're alike, and there's one way that they're positive. So 22, it says, Sam used the model, we're talking about this model right here, I guess, to, um, to find 2 and 5 twelfths minus 1 and 7 twelfths. Did Sam model the problem correctly? Well, so um, we're subtracting 1 and 7 twelfths. And it should have found 7 twelfths. So it's just 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26,